Welcome back, viewers! 10 Best Natural Foods with Creatine for Muscle Growth Are you a frequent shopper for dietary supplements like protein powder or vitamin D capsules? If not, then have you heard of the various fitness supplements? Either way, you probably know creatine, another popular supplement that comes in powder and liquid forms. It's a staple in the bodybuilding world due to its ability to promote muscle growth and boost energy. Although creatine supplements are generally safe, it's not regulated by the FDA. This is where natural foods rich in creatine come into play. These include pork, mutton, and chicken to name some. Keep watching to get to know them better. Before we move on, a like would be awesome. Number 1. Beef Beef alongside pork and sheep are all considered red meat. They contain more iron than fish or chicken. Red meat is an umbrella term used for the meat of mammals. Beef is usually eaten as steaks, roasts, or ribs. It's one of the most complete dietary sources of protein. What's more, its amino acid profile is nearly the same as human muscles. Also, beef is rich in vitamins including vitamin A, E, B3, B12, and B6, as well as minerals like zinc, iron, and selenium. Steak in particular has a high creatine content. A kilo of uncooked steak has 5 grams of creatine. Needless to say, beef is one of the richest sources of creatine. It's perfect for boosting your energy and muscle health. Number 2. Pork Pork has plenty of creatine and protein. A 100-gram serving of pork packs 0.7 grams of creatine. In addition to creatine, pork has good amounts of vitamins and minerals including zinc and potassium. This makes pork a perfect choice for recovering athletes, bodybuilders, and even people who recently underwent surgery. Eating pork won't just increase lean muscle mass, but also improve strength and help in muscle recovery after exercise. You can consume pork either cooked or preserved, whatever suits your fancy. Just be careful of cured pork products like ham and bacon since they contain high levels of salt. Number 3. Chicken Chicken has been a classic staple in most athletes' diets thanks to its high versatility and protein content. It's also the most common type of dietary poultry among all the domestic fowl in the world. It's a wonderful source of lean meat, meaning it's low in fat, and best of all, is loaded with protein and creatine. A 100 gram of chicken already has 23.2 grams, while a kilo of chicken contains 3.4 grams of creatine. Generally, active chickens contain more creatine than those raised in cages and fed with low-quality food. Plus, chicken has long since been seen as a healthy alternative to red meat. Its low levels of saturated fat while still boasting creatine makes it the best choice for many. Number 4. Deer Meat also called venison, deer meat has 50% less fat than beef. So if you're careful with your fat intake or you aren't a fan of beef, then venison makes a great choice. Not only is it lower in fat, but it's also high in creatine, protein, and is a rich source of omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acids. A 100-gram serving of deer meat provides around 4 to 5 grams of creatine. As such, it's an ideal choice for people trying to build lean muscle. Usually, people who had venison describe it as rich and earthy. It's also often enriched with acorns, sage, and herbs that the animal enjoyed eating during its life. Number 5. Rabbit Meat Like chicken, rabbit meat has the same level of creatine, which is about 0.4 grams per 100 gram serving. This healthy, all-white meal is a good source of high-quality proteins, vitamin B12, omega-3s, and minerals such as potassium and calcium. Rabbit is also lean meat and has less cholesterol and fat. And the best part is that compared to pork, beef, and many more, the rabbit has the highest percentage of protein, the fewest calories per pound, and the lowest percentage of fat. Number 6. Mutton Have you ever eaten sheep meat? Mutton is known for its strong flavor. The good thing is that every bit of it is as beneficial for your body as much as lean beef and chicken are. If you can, consider switching lean beef and chicken with lean mutton. This way, you get less fat and improved cardiovascular health. Domestic sheep meat is loaded with creatine and other high-quality proteins. Furthermore, it has high levels of vitamins and minerals including iron, zinc, and vitamin B12. In general, the creatine content of uncooked mutton is 5 grams per kilogram. Number 7. Salmon Salmon is a very common fish boasting pink meaty flesh. 
It's super nutritious and is low-calorie, so it's also ideal for people who are looking to lose weight. And of course, it's an outstanding source of creatine, not to mention protein and omega-3 fatty acids. Thanks to its high-quality protein and heart-healthy fats, anyone can benefit a lot from this fish. A kilo of salmon is known to contain about 4.5 grams of creatine. With that in mind, if you can eat a 3.5-ounce salmon at least twice a week, then it'll be enough to provide your body with sufficient creatine to boost your energy. Additionally, it helps maintain muscle mass for those trying to shed pounds. Salmon also has astaxanthin, an antioxidant that's helpful for the heart, muscles, and skin. Number 8. Herring Another type of fish that's a great source of creatine is herring. Known for its delicious, mild, and flaky taste, herring is filled with omega-3s and creatine. Additionally, it's rich in vitamin E, selenium, and protein. Thus, eating herring can help improve your immune system and reduce the damage caused by free radicals to your body tissues. Out of all the saltwater fishes, herring takes the cake when it comes to the highest amount of creatine, with 3 to 4.5 grams of creatine per pound. Also, compared to other fishes, herring is one of the cleanest kinds, containing a very minimal concentration of mercury. It can also be made in either dried or pickled form. Number 9. Tuna This saltwater fish varies in size. Presently, it's sold with an expensive tag due to overfishing and the fact that tunas don't breed in captivity. It has abundant vitamin B6, cobalamin, magnesium, and creatine. Interestingly, tuna contains more red muscle than any other fish because they do not stop swimming at all. Tuna also has myoglobin, a type of protein in their muscle which is used to burn the oxygen required by its heft muscles. A 100-gram serving of tuna supplies 132 calories, 29 grams of protein, and 0.4 grams of creatine. It might be smelly, but it's the best creatine-rich food. A good combination is tuna salad and tuna sandwich. Number 10. Cod Cod is a white fish with a mild taste. Although it isn't promoted as healthy food, cod is actually the unsung hero with its good amounts of lean protein, creatine, vitamin B complex, and minerals. On top of that, cod is loaded with protein but is low in fat and calories. A 100 gram of cod has 95 calories, 20 grams of protein, 1.4 to 2.3 grams of creatine, and less than 1 gram of fat. As such, it promotes weight loss and good health. You can also consume cod as supplements. The most popular is cod liver oil. So, if there's not much codfish in your area, you can buy cod liver oil capsules instead. How much creatine does the body need? The human body naturally produces small amounts of creatine. So, if you aren't doing super heavy weights or high-intensity workouts or aren't having a vegetarian diet, then your body probably already creates as much creatine as it needs. Protein sources like pork, fish, and beef are rich in creatine. Creatine is naturally found in animal-based products. Therefore, if you have a balanced diet that includes animal-based foods, then you're good to go. If you wish to supplement your body with creatine, consider taking 5 grams of creatine 4 times per day during the loading period. Afterward, you can decrease the amount to 3 or 4 grams per day for the maintenance period. Does cooking reduce the creatine content? Now that you've learned the best 10 natural food sources of creatine, it's important to note that cooking can reduce the creatine content of the meat. The amount that's lost will depend mostly on the type and cut of meat, but the duration of cooking is also a factor. One thing you must keep in mind is that a good amount of creatine goes to the juice of the meat during cooking. As such, you may consider consuming this by making a sauce out of it or pouring it over the meat as you cook. Which of those foods do you like most and least? Drop your answers below. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. For more interesting facts on the human body, subscribe to the channel. Here are two more videos you should check out, both of them will definitely help you reach your goals.